Welcome to ProSource Muscle Vision. Today, ProSource sits here at headquarters in MHP with first runner-up finisher in the Mr. Olympia 07, Victor Martinez. Victor, welcome and congratulations on your, you. on your victory. We all do. Victor, um, who do you think should have really won that, that contest? Oh, well, I have to say Mama. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, I mean, given that, you know, you follow, you know, the criticism and the right judgment of bodybuilding, mm -hmm. you know, and given her, I looked, you know, pictures don't lie. And also, um, what most people saw, and I know what the judges saw, but, you know, a lot of times it doesn't happen that way, not in this sport, and sometimes not in other sports where it involves decisions, you know. Unlike when it's a, you know, sport like hockey yeah. where that's it. You know? Do you think there's a popularity favoritism towards uh, people who have already at, been at the top, and since you're such a fast riser, maybe that could have had something to do with or afraid of you uh, coming on so strong so soon? Um, there is, and, you know, I mean, it's something, you know, like I say, you just kind of deal with um, many pro bodybuilders in the past. Has boy, um, they have voiced this, you know, about this, you know, ongoing problem, and, you know, they voice their opinion on it, and, uh, you know, it's great, you see it, you hear them speak their mind, but um, the problem is usually there's no change. So they keep voicing their opinion, and they keep seeing this happening, and nothing changes. Yeah. You know, all I can say is, I'll be back next year. Yeah, so something like that doesn't discourage you, no, just motivate doesn't. you to move on, and your date, your your turn will come. Yep, exactly. There you go. You know. Uh, who do you see in the top five in next year's Olympia? Um, definitely me. You know, there's one already, so when we choose the next four, uh, Jake Cutler being, you know, two-time Mr. Olympia, you know. Should have been one. Uh, <laughs> uh, you have uh, Dexter, who's always, you know, there and, and tough to be. Um, you have Dennis Wolf, it, like I said, you know, he's, he's moving up. Um, and last one, I have to say, uh, I have to say Mo and Anthony. I mean, they are pushing uh, Bellevue, but. Uh, I have to say no and Anthony, being that he still has uh, the size over him. You know, definitely my top five right there. If you could address Mr. Cutler right now, what would you say to him? Um, better start letting that grip go on that sandal, man. He's coming <laughs> home over here, buddy. <laughs> Next year ain't no dress rehearsal, is it? No, no dress rehearsal. It's <laughs> going to be a whole new different, you know, not one point you know, more of a landslide. Also in your preparation, Victor, I, I see that you uh, silence a lot of your critics by coming in the top, best shape of your life. Uh, what were some of the, the things that, help, that helped you uh, peak? Well, you know, over the years, you know, I always tweak my diet, I always, you know, tweak my cardio, and, you know, there was always something missing, and, and finally, you know, when Gerard said, you know, Victor, try this new product, you know, and then, you know, he told me about Dren, and uh, I tried it out about 12 weeks out, and just the thermogenic level that my body reached was, you know, so great that I was actually getting ready, you know, every 10 days, you'll see the difference, you know, every 10, 15 days, you'll see a difference in my body is changing, you know, my cardio became simpler. You know, so you find like, yourself way ahead of yourself. You're like, wow, I'm not supposed to look like this right now. And yeah, well, that is always good, you know. Yeah. That is always good because you can always pull back, you know. Yeah. It's always taking it to the last minute where I always took it, you know, to the last minute, you know, um, in past shows. But this time I was so ahead, you know, I was ready three weeks out. And uh, just taking the dream every morning before my morning cardio, it just gave me that extra joke, you know. I didn't even the coffee I didn't need till about three weeks out this time around. Well, usually I had start drinking coffee, you know, eight weeks, you know, just to get the extra, you know, joke in the morning. But uh, it was it was totally a big difference this year. And uh, so it's definitely something new over the past years of you 
something better than you've, you've used ever before. You know? Yeah, so now I said it, now guys are going to use it, you know, against me in shows, you know. <laughs> so, we just Gerard out. has to come out with something else. So new. Like <laughs> <solve something. laughs> Victor, you, you, you mentioned uh, before your, your inspiration right now is, is, is your children in your life and helped with your motivation, your success. Um, I understand you're involved with some charities that, uh, that involve your kids. And what are they you'd like to talk about for a little bit? Yeah, um, well, you know, I like to, you know, mention that, you know, bodybuilding has helped me so much, you know, over the, you know, these years and, um, you know, motivation being my, my children and uh, two of my boys have autism and uh, just watching them struggle and me struggle over the years and seeing them grow up and learn how to have, you know, it's, it hasn't been easy seeing them grow up, you know, trying to, you know, associate with normal kids in school, you know, as they say, normal. But um, right now, I just joined uh, Athletes Against Autism. Um, if you go to the website, um, you can see a lot of the uh, football, basketball, you know, baseball players are actually, you know, part of it. I'm um, doing a lot of charity. For, um, well, I'm going to do my first one in October. Uh, it's going to be a, you know, Halloween event, you know, to raise money. And, uh, you know, this is just the beginning. And this is something I'm using bodybuilding to promote, you know, and to help, you know, the awareness of autism and uh, basically any other charity. You know, I've done the Myositis Society. I just did that before the Olympia um, for a friend of mine whose daughter has myositis. Um, but, you know, autism, I'll be more active, you know, being that, you know, my sons do have it and uh, just staying positive that they are going to be okay. and. Uh, let people know, you know, be aware, you know, if your kids have it, you know, that there is help and there are things being done, you know, to help your kids, you know, so they could be better. Well, Victor, uh, ProSource Net would like to thank you and MHP for being on ProSource Muscle Vision. And oh, thank you for having me. And, and your stand up guy. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. Um, thank you, Victor Martinez. Victor, you know, three weeks. Uh, after the Olympia, why don't you uh, give the fans a treat and uh, show them what you still got? Okay, it's a two week aftermath. You know, this is, you know, eating good, feeling happy. ProSource Muscle Vision is brought to you by ProSource, your number one source for bodybuilding and fitness supplements. Visit us online at ProSource.net.